Skeleton finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Zombie finger, zombie finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Which finger, which finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Vampire finger, vampire finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Ghost finger, ghost finger, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? <laughs> wow, Groovy! You look really handsome today! But what are those buttons? One has a nice smiley face on it. And the other a bad and angry one. But don't press them. It has a don't touch sign on it. No, Groovy! Wow! Is it a magic mirror? The reflection shows an even nicer and sweeter Groovy. Oh, he's so cute! <laughs> <gasps> what happened? Wow, Phoebe accidentally hit the mirror, but she hit the red button. What's going to happen now? Oh no! Now the reflection shows an evil Groovy! What's he gonna do? Groovy, be careful! Oh no! Now Groovy's trapped in the mirror, and his evil version is out to play tricks! What can we do? Groovy is red because it's not groovy. You see, there was a magic mirror with a don't touch sign on it, and then Groovy and I were playing, and we pressed the red button, and now Groovy is trapped inside. And this evil Groovy is out. Look out, he's running away. That's it, Groovy. That was fast. What a team. What a beautiful day for learning at school. There you go. Groovy, it looks great on you. It will make you look even cuter in the group photo you're taking today. Doing? Come on, get up. You're going to be late. Ready for the photo? Come on, it's time. How elegant. It's going to be a beautiful picture. You 
too, Phoebe. There's something weird going on here. Groovy, let me look. Oh no, lice! Guys, guys, it's okay. Having lice is normal, but we must stop them quickly. Pop will explain to us how to do it. Lice and their eggs are parasites. That is, they live in your head, rent-free, paying nothing. They like clean hair, even if you wash every day. You can still have them. They spread very fast. You have to stop them immediately. How? With an anti-lice shampoo. And if the problem persists, with a special comb. Here we go. Wow, there's lots of them. And they want to keep spreading through the heads of all of the kids. Come on, we must hurry. The lice are already jumping. Oh no, this is getting out of hand. We've got to do something now. Nice try, Groovy, but they're jumping too much. Good thinking, Groovy, but they're so fast, they're already on every head. And now they also want to conquer the professor's head. Yes, it's lice. Guys, we have to do something before the whole school is overrun with lice. Shall we try the good stuff first? Maybe we can try to convince them to leave. We must try it. Mr. Louse, we come in peace. Please leave our heads. We can give you lots of gifts like these in return. Oh yeah? Well, if diplomacy doesn't work, we'll take action. They wanted it. This is a job for Super Groovy and Super Phoebe. What's on your mind, Groovy? Kids, what do you think Groovy has to become to get rid of lice? An electric guitar? Knit shampoo? Or a teaspoon? Yes, it's shampoo. Run, little lice. We want you out of our heads. Now let's shampoo the children as well. Good job, Groovy. It seems it's working. Guys, 
Guys, they're leaving. Congratulations. Let's see if we can now take the group photo. Smile. Let's say lice. Oh no, these lice are heavy. Hi, I'm the potty. Come on in. Hi, potty. I need to pee. Pull down your pants. Yes, now your underwear. Sit on the potty and pee. Yes, pee. Pee slides down the potty. Wee, 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 wee. Potty, nice to meet you. I'll use you again. Meet the potty, meet the potty, meet the potty. What a beautiful day to learn in school. And what are you learning today? Ah, the basic emotions. Pops, shall we go over them again? Joyful, when a big smile is drawn on our faces. <laughs> Sad, if we can't help crying. Fearful, when we open our eyes and mouth wide, scared. <laughs> Angry, if we frown and pout. <laughs> Thanks, Pops. Children, did you learn them? Very, very well. Great, then. The task for tomorrow is to bring a picture of every emotion learned today. Joyful, sad, fearful, and angry. The garden is a good place to take pictures, don't you think, kids? Great choice, Phoebe. The photo will have a beautiful background. Hey, Groovy. You are finally going to fulfill your dream of being a model. Pose for us. <laughs> All right. Now pretend you're super happy. Hey, you don't look really happy. Let's try better with sadness. Come on, Groovy. Hmm, it's going to be more difficult than I thought. Pops has an idea to make the photos work. Provoke Groovy's emotions. But shh, it's better that Groovy doesn't know. What a scary pose, Groovy. Perfect picture. You already have one emotion, fear. Let's continue with the next one. Hmm. That broccoli looks great. 
How happy Groovy is. Oh no, it wasn't for you, Groovy. You're so sad. Great! Two emotions and one to go. Joy and sadness. We only have one left to complete the album. Oh no! The camera is broken! There is the missing emotion. Anger. What a pity that we can't take a picture of Phoebe, but... What about a drawing? Yes, you can draw anger in the album directly. What's the matter? Don't you have something to draw with? I see. Groovy, can you help us? Children, what should Groovy transform into to draw on the album? A pearl necklace? A marker? Or a rugby ball? Yes, into a marker. Great. It's fantastic, Phoebe. The album is full. Homework done. You can play now. Oh, an A+. Plus. That's really something to be cheerful about, kids. Let's see those smiles. Cheer up, Groovy. You'll end up doing it well. What a beautiful day to play with all these toys. Groovy, watch out! <laughs> what a crash! Oh, what's wrong with Phoebe? Kids, could you tell me? How does Phoebe feel? Joyful? Fearful? Angry? Or sad? That's it. Phoebe is sad. Nice try. Oh, Phoebe must be very sad not to laugh with you. Groovy, it's okay if Phoebe's sad. Emotions aren't bad. They help us to know what we are feeling. We need to find out why Phoebe's sad. What's the matter, Phoebe? Why are you sad? Oh no, Snuggles is gone. Now we understand why Phoebe feels so sad. <laughs> Snuggles is her pet, and she loves him very much. 
Wait a minute. But Snuggles always leaves for a while. But you're worried because he hasn't come back yet. How long has he been gone? Don't worry, Phoebe. We're going to help you find him. Phoebe, have you looked around already? And the rest of the garden? Yes, the garden is very big and Snuggles is very small. We need help to find him quickly. Groovy, can you help us? Children, what should Groovy transform into to find Snuggles? A toy truck? A helicopter? Or a slipper? Exactly! Into a helicopter! Great! are. He's stuck in the fence. Oh, so much love. How beautiful. I love stories with a happy ending. Phoebe has gone from being sad to joyful thanks to our friendship. Yay! Ha <laughs> ha, <laughs> <laughs> Snuggles is having a great time. <laughs> and Groovy too!